Hey everyone, here is how I like to do an heirloom edit. Um, real quick, I just make a copy of my background. And the first thing I like to do is get a paintbrush and select the color that I want to paint. So I like to pick kind of one of the darker whites um, to start with. And I make sure my brush is very soft and has um, a lower op opacity and lower flow. Um, so as I go in here and start painting away, it is just going to add um, the color I want, but not too crazy. There we go. I might turn this up a little, a little bit more. And you just start painting away, especially those edges where maybe their clothes are or their arms are showing. We want to make sure we don't really see any of that. So once you kind of have this blended in, you want to make sure it's not touching any part of them too much. If that is the style you're going for. The next thing I like to do is um, make another copy is go into my dodge tool so this is going to lighten up anything um, i have it on the exposure 61 percent and i like to work with a really big brush so i'm just going to go literally to kind of the corners here just kind of paint that on really softly and then that's just going to brighten up those edges you can even do it a little bit more with your exposure if you want to. I think my brush is so big it doesn't want to do anything else. Okay, so you can go in the edges and kind of just brighten it up a bit until you're happy with your vignette. Um, if you feel like it's too much, you can always go to the opacity over here and turn down the opacity of that brightening. I think it looks good. And one last step that I like to do just to kind of make it um, a little more fine art is I'll make another copy. I'm sure there's another way to do this, but I like to go in with my blur tool and really low. I like to just kind of touch up their skin just a hair on kind of like the, the main areas of their skin. Nothing too intense or crazy. And then I like to go in with the sharpen tool and just sharpen up some of their features like their eyes, eyelashes, eyebrows, um, the tip of their nose, their lips here, as well as some of their hair. Um, and this just kind of makes it pop a little bit more. My style is really uh, more clean. So I think this just makes it look a little more um, fine art. And there you have it. That is how I do an heirloom edit. You can see the before and after.